Hey guys, what's up? It's Kevin the Cool Game Cat here with another video uh, for the arm wrestling fans out there and your training and, and what you're doing out there. Uh, just some stretches. Some stretches that kind of help me with, with, you know, the pain and stuff in the wrist, um, the carpal tunnel in here. So a couple stretches I learned. It kind of stretches out the nerves all the way up to your neck and down the other side. So what, what you want to do is put your arm out like this, okay, and then you turn your hand, right? You can already feel it kind of stretching, okay? And you can do that a couple times just to kind of soften it up a bit. And then what you want to do is make sure your shoulder's back, arm out, and you tilt your head. Now make sure your shoulder's back and you tilt your head like this, and you just hold it. And you can kind of start feeling, feeling the pressure. And you switch back to the other side and you flip your hand the other way. And you try to st stretch your neck as far back, far to the side as you can. And you hold it and you flip back like that. And I can already start feeling it. It starts to get numb, actually. And that's when you kind of have to stop. It's already getting numb. You can really feel it up in here. You can actually put both arms out and do both sides at the same time, kind of back and forth. Then some hand exercises. What you want to do is put your hands together and try to make it so it's a square. With your fingertips touching. And you want to hold that for about 10 15 seconds. And you want to flip your hands up, stretch them out like that. 10, 15 seconds again. And then you wanna curl your fingers down like this. So that part's straight up. And if you feel any tightness in your knuckles, that means you probably have some sort of issue, underlying issue there. When I first started, I couldn't even close my finger it was like that I couldn't even close it now I can kind of close it but it, it's really really hard to do you want to keep doing that like if you can do that a couple times every hour throughout the day um, your symptoms will get a lot better that's what I've been doing it takes a long time and just keep on Stretching your knuckles and your hands. And the last one I'm going to show is you put your hand down and then you, you put your other hand on top. And then you kind of try to lift up your hands, your, your one hand. So you force it down with your, your left hand, your right hand. You want to try to lift up. You just do that a whole bunch of times. Well, guys, I hope this helped anybody with carpal tunnel symptoms and pain, and it can help with a lot of other stuff too. So, thanks for checking out the video. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.